obviously unemployed, you're obviously without a job, are you still able to make money, how are you supporting yourself? I am obviously unemployed because I am a nurse, I am college educated, but because I wouldn't withdraw my First Amendment right on behalf of my handicapped child, Justice Breyer and this entire Supreme Court has been keeping me chronically unemployed. So it sounds like you've got a lot of political uh, issues or a lot of angst or anger toward the government. Well, not all government sections, but particularly the judiciary system in the society. Um, if you look at Bill Windsor, uh, Rodney Stitch, all these people who have been kept outside the protections of the law, just like myself, I received death threats, pornography, we've been homeless six times in the last uh, two years, I'm currently living in the Y in a room with my 15 year old son, I am not allowed to work, I applied for jobs, one of the tenants of being unemployed is to be able to look for a job, but the government lawyer who contacts the employer who stops me from working, they want me to withdraw my lawsuit. I'm in the process of trying to get to the international criminal court. I am, have committed no crimes, have not been arrested, have not harbored any terrorists. I've put many of um, my feelings online at the Full Disclosure website because I know that they have been doing work on Attorney Richard Klein, who has also suffered tremendously by judicial corruption. So all in all, you support the message here at Occupy Wall Street? I support uh, the Occupy Wall Street. Yes, I support the message, but I believe also that the institutions in America has to change and that the judiciary is a place of debauchery and outright lies and that the people have lost their constitutional rights. All right. Great job. Thank you so much. Thank you. Nice to Thank meet you. you. Uh, when is it going to be on the It'll news? be on tonight at 5. Let me just get a shot of you.